Hi everyone, I'm Rebecca O'Neill, the project coordinator for Wikimedia Community Ireland, and I'm going to talk to you about a new Erasmus project we have started in 2022 called Wiki Women. Wikimedia Community Ireland was created in 2014 by a group of enthusiastic Wikimedians who met at the first Editathon hosted in Ireland, which marked the millennium of the Battle of Clontarf. We are now a group of 12 to 15 active core volunteers who work across Wikimedia projects, supported by one staff member, me. Increasingly, our work has moved more and more into promoting the use of the Irish language, Wikipedia, Wikipedia, as well as the use of the Irish language on projects such as Wikimedia Commons and Wikidata. Irish is an official language of both Ireland and the European Union and is taught in schools from ages 4 to 18. However, only about 1% of the Irish population speak Irish daily or live their lives through Irish. We believe that supporting more Irish on Wikimedia projects is key to supporting those who live through Irish and encourage more to feel empowered to do the same. In 2020, I was interviewed by this podcast, The Europeans, to speak about the gender gap on Wikipedia. Having heard that episode, Simon Tubb of Learning Hub Friesland contacted me about a possible collaboration with organizations in Friesland through the Erasmus Plus EU program. The core idea was to get students to edit or create articles about women in their minority language Wikipedia. We contacted the Basque Wikimedia user group as they have a well-established relationship with local schools that gives them expertise in delivering the sort of program we had envisaged. We worked on the proposal that would build into established best practice um, from across the Wikimedia movement from 2020. And in late 2021, we received confirmation that our proposal was successful. The project called Wiki Women is inspired by numerous initiatives from across the movement, but in particular, Women in Red. It is centered on three languages, Basque, Irish, and Frisian, which are all minority languages within their countries. A central aim is to focus on writing biographies of women with particular relevance to their local context and to raise awareness of the importance of their language and these histories with the student editors and the language group more widely. The funding was received through the Erasmus Plus programme, Cooperation, Partnerships and School Education, called 2021, in the context of field school education. There are seven named partner organisations spread across three regions. Learning Hub Friesland, AFUC Friesk Academy in Friesland, Euroscal Wiki Laren Kultur El Carta in, and Institut Anti Luberia BHI in the Basque Country and Wikimedia Community Ireland and Colosh de Oriel in Ireland. We have stated aims and outcomes for this project, which include the project will bring together schools, Wikimedia projects, and language organizations in minority language regions of Europe to use Wikipedia as a tool to teach digital literacy, social engagement, and language skills. We aim to create a new generation of secondary school pupils who are equipped with the vital digital and research skills that they will need for, future, for the future, empowered to work and produce content in their minority language and engage with social issues such as gender equality and the wider position of their language community. Over the next three years, we have a schedule of virtual and in-person events for both project partners, but also the groups of students and teachers involved. The first major event is taking place this week from the 27th of June to the 1st of July, 2022, with a Wikimedia bootcamp in San Sebastian in the Basque Country for all the teachers and educators involved in the project. Wikimedians from the Basque Country and Ireland will give the participants a crash co course in all things Wikimedia, from making their first edits to uploading images and using the, the outreach dashboard in their own languages. There are three student trips planned in 2023, and 2024, which will see the students visit each other to work on their articles about women. At the end of this project, a major outcome is the development of three packs, pupil materials, a, a school's toolkit, and a GLAM toolkit, which can be reused, localized, and adapted for use in other minority languages to empower students, educators, and GLAM professionals to launch their own Wikiwomen projects in their own language communities. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy the rest of the conference. Please get in touch if you want to discuss anything further with me via email or on Twitter. Thank you.